Hi there. Good morning. Happy Tuesday. Good morning. Hi, I'm here with Chris, the long officer, one of the famous ones. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. So I'm a mortgage banker with Atlantic Bay Mortgage Group. Uh, been in the industry, what, 16 years now, just about. So been around the block or two. Yeah, and he just recently helped out my uh, VA buyer, and we just closed, and uh, um, we have a rate transaction. He's always answered his phone. I appreciate yes. that. Yes, and uh, see, I am a realtor, so we are in our office this morning, and we'd like to go over like so many rate programs for first-time home buyer. So here we go, Chris. Yeah, so today I wanted to just kind of briefly touch on, we do have the VA VHDA program. We, you know, many of you know the VA program does allow for 100% financing, but the VHDA program does offer a 2% grant, which will allow for you to help pay for 2% of the purchase price you get as a grant to help pay the closing costs. In this market, you know, you may not have an amazing real estate agent like Melissa uh, to help negotiate all your closing costs, but if you don't or you're just unable to do that, maybe take advantage of the VHDA grant if you're a first time home buyer and you have 2% of those closing costs covered by uh, this, uh, by VHDA, so. Right. Yeah, so do do not let the seller market, you know, stop you for uh, to own a home. Everyone deserves right. a home. And I am here to show you recent transaction. So um, the buyer got 3.5% closing costs. We just closed uh, last week, you see? that three and a half percent right there. And I also have another VA buyer that have three percent closing costs. It's not easy, but if the house meant for you, it would uh, be there. And also the seller, there's so many sellers out there not about the bond number. So they do care about um, first time home buyer. So they want this person deserve a home and sound like other people. So just keep that in mind. Hard work will pay off. Right, Chris? Uh, absolutely. And I mean, the other thing to keep in mind is, um, you know, beside, if you're not buying a home, you're going to need to rent a home and the rental market's just as crazy or, and you're going to pay more in rent than you are to buy a home in this market. So, um, yeah, I mean, we were looking at a home recently, the rent was, you know, over $1,800 a month. And I mean, that's less than or about the same as what you pay, or I mean, I'm sorry, the rent was more than what you'd pay probably for a mortgage payment for that same home, so. Yeah, so this is Chris' website, so if you need to apply for the mortgage, you just click right here, or you can stop by the office to see me, and I can walk through the whole process, or uh, Chris, you know. <laughs> right. Well, I appreciate that, but yeah, well, thank you so much. Thank you, and we will give you more information on the next episode. There you go. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Have a good day. Goodbye.